The full moon on the 13th is filling you with a passion to explore the world, to travel, to be amongst people who think slightly differently. And this is great for you. When you're around people that think differently, you're very enthusiastic about all of life's possibilities. There's nothing worse for you than being around people that are very stuck or very staid or repeat the same pattern over and over again. So get bouncy, get optimistic and find yourself some fellow adventurers and get out there and strut your stuff. A lot of the energy of this month is all about you coming into your power when it comes to communication. However, Mercury is going retrograde. So it's not about expressing yourself and saying everything that's in your mind, which is very difficult for us Aries not to do. It's more about thinking about ideas, planning things, writing things down and sort of plotting the future. There's a little pentagram at the end of this month, which is quite extraordinary and is bringing you together to think about your relationships and your emotions. And it could be a little bit overwhelming. You're thinking about your responsibilities, the way you've dealt with relationships in the past. You want balance, you want to express yourself and you want a soulful element to your relationships. Something is healing, something is occurring, something is changing and it's all about balance. Very important for you not to get annoyed with people from your past or to think about things with resentment, but more see your past relationships as a training ground for your soul where you learn many, many lessons. The future for you, particularly when it comes to love, is very bright. There's a brand new era ahead. Take care and I'll speak to you soon.